Hello again. Welcome to the Virtual Electrician, TVE, your one-stop shop for do-it-yourself electrical help. Yes, believe it or not, we are still talking about troubleshooting outlets. The reason is that there are a lot of things that can go wrong, especially with what people are plugging into them. That's what I want to talk about today. Some people think you can just plug anything into an outlet and there not be any consequences. Not true! What you really need to do is check the watts of what you are plugging in and make sure that the circuit breaker the outlet is connected to can handle that load. Common things people mistakenly plug in that cause damage are space heaters, treadmills, and Christmas lights. Those little suckers add up and a lot of time require a dedicated circuit. We get a lot of calls with space heaters in the winter time. Those suckers can pull anywhere from 600 to 1400 watts. Make sure you check the label on the back of the heater. If you plug one of these things in and the outlet does stop working, turn the breaker off if it didn't already trip and inspect that outlet. You may find out that the wire has been stabbed into the back of the outlet. This is bad. Over time, these wires loosen up and when you plug a heavy load into it, you burn up the wire. Loose connections cause arcing. Arcing causes heat and heat causes fire. You need to remove the damaged wire and then wrap the wires around the new outlet screws instead of stabbing it in. This will give you a nice solid connection. If the problem wasn't at the outlet, check that circuit's neutral wire at the panel. If it was loose, the same thing could have happened there. Check out TVE to hire a virtual electrician if you need help doing these things.